Battery TV. We're here with uh, one of our uh, organization favorites here, Chris Lieben. How you doing, Chris? Not too bad, not too bad. How you doing? I'm doing well. So, uh, tell us what you've been doing. You've been making some waves out there. Yeah, we have been fighting, been fighting a lot. Had a, had a couple fights. Had the, the Team Quest fight you saw. Then I had uh, Boyd Ballard up in Seattle. And then uh, Brandon Silman down at uh, WEC. So did, did some good things there, and now I'm just gonna take a little break for a couple, for about a month and a half, two months, for the next WEC to come up and go back to work. <laughs> so let's talk a little bit about that Boyd Ballard fight. Um, a lot of people, a lot of people are I mean, in, in Boyd's, in, in Boyd's uh, hometown, because he was, he's, he's, you know, people like to say he's unstoppable. What do you think? Well, that's that's true. He's definitely the home the hometown favorite, but also um, Otto Wilson was the hometown favorite too up there. And uh, on his tail. Yeah, yeah. And Landon Showwater was also there, guys. So I took out his stable mate, so he was he was going in there ready to fight. I know I know he wanted to to bring that belt back since you know they, they want somebody locally to have that belt, but unfortunately he didn't get that chance. So now you've been training. You're training with Team Quest. You're training with the. Uh, you know, the Team Quest teammates, which is uh, Randy, Matt, and at times Danny Henderson, and Robert, and um, you know, the rest of the guys, the up-and-comers. Um, what do you work on? What, what do you feel the need to work on? Uh, I definitely got to work, I don't know, man, everything. Everything, for sure. I definitely have to work a lot more on my on my stand-up, um, keeping my hands up. I definitely I got rocked in my last fight. Recovered and it worked out all right, but I don't want to be known as the guy that can take hits real good. I don't want to be known as the guy that can evade them real good. So, well, it certainly doesn't help. It certainly doesn't hurt that you've got that reputation that you can take a shot. Yeah, it doesn't, but I, I'd still rather be known as the guy that can that can stick and move and dodge, not the guy that stands in front of you. It's kind of, kind of what I've been doing my last couple of fights. So. Because I was talking to Randy Couture about you oh, probably four or five months ago. And, uh, I said, so, you know, I said, tell, tell me about this. Tell me about this. Thing. What's going on with this thing? Randy, of course, smiled at me and said, he likes oh. pain. <laughs> Is that true? I don't, I don't know if I if I like it. I mean, it's not... It motivates you. It does a little bit, definitely. That's that's one of the things. When somebody hits me, instead of getting out of their way, I just really want to hit them back. Right. You know? So that's kind of an issue I'm working on right now. So, so you're, you're, kind of a, you're, you're kind of under a control state of uh, being pissed off, I guess? I, I'm definitely a real aggressive fighter. I like to get the job done. I don't, I don't like to wait around. So, yeah, I would, I would say that for sure. All right. Well, this is Chris Needham. Thanks for coming. All right. Thank you. Thanks.